I'm Pastor George Borkart, and this is another Higher Things Video Short. It's okay to be joyful. You know the end of the story. That's the subject of today's Higher Things Video Short. Like, subscribe, ring the bell, get the app, donate. If you love what we're doing in Higher Things, pass it on that faith to the next generation. Like our videos, subscribe to our YouTube channel, ring the bell for notifications. Get our app. It's available on all major platforms. And donate. Your tax-deductible gift keeps higher things a youth organization all about passing the faith to the next generation. Keeps us a rolling. And you need his gifts. They need, children need his gifts in these dark times. I'd like to, um, I'd like to review on Fridays something that may have interested me during the week in the Bible study. And here, John 16, 22 so you have sorrow now, but I will see you again, and your hearts will rejoice, and no one will take your joy from you. So this is originally about the apostles. They um, were going to, Jesus was going to leave them, die for them, but after three days, he was going to rise for them. The world would celebrate, the world would rejoice, and they would weep. But he would see them again, and their sorrow would be turned into joy. This is also an Easter text, Easter season text, about the Lord's ascension. That the Lord goes away, he sends the Holy Spirit, but he comes back again and turns our joy, our, our sorrow, into joy. Now, for us, living in these latter days in America, it could seem a little bit crazy. Um, We have an election which may or may not be over, depending on who you talk to. Uh, legal battles, which are coming, which may or may not have merit, depending on who you talk to. A, a, vac, a, a virus, which may be under control or may not, depending on who you talk to. A future, which is bright or dark, depending on who you talk to. A world filled with uncertainty. And we don't know how it's going to turn out. Well, they don't know how it's going to turn out. You know how it's going to turn out. See, in these last Sundays of the church here, this could be happening at a better time for us. You see, our Lord reminds us that he's coming back and that when he returns, he will turn our sadness and our uncertainty and our unbelief and our despair into joy. You see, because we will see him and we will know him. And best of all, we, will, we are known by him. And so we got nothing to fear in the, uh, the midst of the uncertainty of the world. And it's nothing to fear because it's not nothing to fear because we have pulled up our bootstraps and we've made our decision and we're going to go forward and we're going to do this and that. No, because we know the end of the story. The one who died for us has risen from the dead for us and lives for us and has ascended to the right hand of God and he will come for us. And the way it looks sooner rather than later. And so our faith and trust and our hope is in him and him alone. He alone can save. And so in the midst of all this uncertainty and here in these last Sundays of the church year, it's okay to be joyful because you know how it ends. It ends with your salvation. So as everything goes to pot, look up because your redemption draws near. I'm Pastor George Barkart, and this has been another Higher Things video short.